Let's watch the round of 32 matches played between Dadio and Go VN in the GP3 Cyber Friends vs VN Team Tournament in Tennis Clash, a sports game published by Wide Life Studios. Let's watch this first match. Dadio chose an unusual level 9 capping lineup for Kaito using the anvil instead of the haters threats giving less agility two strong hands of course he doesn't need as much stamina in a seven points format match as in the classic tennis clash tournaments play on ten points the big mistake here in this first match for Dadio was to take the uh, only card instead of uh, backhand counter special string indeed Ko VN was playing with uh, Florence having a strong backhand so whenever the Ko VN's Florence was hitting with a strong backhand shot Dadio had no precision too bad but I guess that Dadio couldn't have asked it Ko VN to replay not really to replay but uh, to cancel the first match and to restart it playing with a backhand counter however he didn't and he chose to play with the only card of course playing with a forehand counter string <laughs> gives him only the critical shot tier 2 and the stamina shield tier 2 but no protection at all versus the strong shots of uh, Go Vien. who took advantage easily of the absence of uh, backhand counter from Dadio in this first match of course now and then Ko Vien was hitting with the weaker forehand of Florence and in that case Dadio had the advantage a bit like in the two last points when he succeeded in targeting the weaker forehand of Ko Vien when he come back it seems a bit late and indeed it is too late Ko Vien takes the lead with this first win in this second match Dadio switched to a classic counter puncher lineup using Florence not Kato anymore same special string than Ko Vien this is uh, the classic counter puncher lineup that we see very often in tournaments in capping 9 and now I guess that uh, we will have a better match quality of course with uh, higher agility this Florence is going to move more swiftly you can clearly see the difference between a 65 agility Florence and a 59 agility Kaito now that you has precision on almost all returns of Ko Vien and that changes almost everything he's feeling a bit more comfortable however he was still not so accurate and Ko Vien was not so accurate either nice winner from Ko Vien after summon Fossil Ross and now it's Dadio's turn to commit an Fossil Ross so many mistakes in this match a lot of Fossil Ross
Nice down the line shot from Dadio. Nice defensive shot from Dadio. And Dadio comes back in this uh, round of 32 for 1-1 one, one score. Both players keep the same lineup and same special string for this third match. Let's see if uh, they have warmed up their fingers and we commit to less and force errors now. This starts with a nice first winner from Kovien. A lot of critical shots. This tiger card is activating critical much more often if you hit very strong shots than the wire to wire or the cola string. It has critical tier 3. Classic counter punch shot from Kovien. Nice one. Very nice shot there from Kovien, who tries to target the weaker forehand of uh, Dadio first before hitting hard the other corner. It seems to work for Kovien to outflank Dadio. It works again for Kovien. Very nice defense. From Kovien and Dadio was cracking. Yeah, seems the gap uh, in terms of score was too big, and Dadio was a bit frustrated by the end of this third match. Kovien is leading now 2 1, and Dadio surprisingly is switching to white wire, which has the same ability than the Tiger card, but it has critical shot tier 2 instead of tier 3 for the Tiger card. We should wipe a mode for Kovien before hitting twice on the same side. Classic strategy, but it works. Three, but he generally hits on forehand side of Dadio first. Out. After the serve Four, of Dadio five. especially. He stacks the attacks by hitting on the forehand. And now and then, he delays the shots to see where Dadio is positioning his Florence and to try and trigger a good attack. Wow, in this fourth match, looks like Dadio can't figure out the hitting pattern of Kovien, who is on fire and who wins this fourth match quite easily 7-0 Kovien is now leading a score of 3-1 for the uh, fifth match both players were switching to serve volley Kovien has no pressure of course
he plays a lot with volley in tour matches. Surprising choice of string for Dadio. I wouldn't have chosen Master Monty or New Year String or any strings having quick catch instead of the only card which has of course precision on the forehand returns of Leo but which has no quick catch so that's the big problem returns of that you can't disturb Kovian and with this ultimate smash Kovian qualifies for the round of 16 where he will face Toruni from the VN team so you're watching now the lineups used by both players in miscellaneous matches of this round of 32 well I hope you enjoy this first round matches played between Dadio and Ko VN in the GP3 Cyber Friends vs VN Team Tournament in Tennis Clash, a sports game published by Wide Life Studios. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel Gameplay 5 and to turn on the bell to stay tuned for new videos of the tournament. Thank you a lot for your support and see you soon on Gameplay 5 Bye bye!